Hello everyone and welcome again to GUAP is a gaming channel trying to put some fun back into gaming. As you can see I've got some Modern Warfare uh, gameplay for you. Oh gameplay, it's uh, the first part of the actual campaign itself. Uh, it's only the first part, I ain't going to go any further into it so if you haven't played it yet or you're, you, you just undecided where to buy it. Uh, yeah, have a watch, have a look. So, uh, Infinite Warfare versus Modern Warfare. Uh, do you know what? Uh, I haven't really played Infinite Warfare online yet. Uh, obviously, I played the beta. Uh, bought some gameplay and all that sort of stuff up. But, yeah, I haven't, well, I bought the game and you got four, well, you, you got zombies as well, haven't you? But you, you do get a bit more than multiplayer, so... I've been doing a bit more streaming, as you've noticed. I've done a Hall Halloween one. Uh, thanks for watching, Sam. <laughs> you make me laugh, old lad. Uh, yeah, and a few other things. But uh, I was thinking to myself, how can you do a 10-minute video after playing half hour of a game and say, this is how it is. So what, I, what I've decided to do, I'm going to stream the game, then obviously do a video about it. Uh, I was going to stream Modern Warfare, to be, uh, but to be honest, uh, I... I might do. I might. I might stream the rest of it. Uh, I don't want wants me to do that type of thing. I actually quite enjoy it. Actually, it's actually. I wouldn't say easier for me to stream, but it it's quicker. Uh, the last, <laughs> the last game, I, uh, last video I did, I uh, it was Modern War, no Infinite Warfare, wasn't it? And it like took four hours to upload, whereas I can stream and it's instantly there. So I'm gonna do both. I'm gonna do both, both like I said. So yeah, let's go into it. So. The multiplayers, uh, I haven't actually played the latest multiplayer, i.e. Infinite Warfare since the updates, but I haven't heard good things. But I have noticed there's more people streaming Infinite Warfare than Modern Warfare. So, multiplayer, eh, seems quite good on Infinite Warfare. Modern Warfare, do you know what? I actually remember the game. I, 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 I could, I can remember... I get to run and all that sort of stuff. So, but I never played the multiplayer. I never had the internet at the time, so I didn't really experience the multiplayer. But it's all right. It's very snipey. But yeah, and I actually miss sliding and well, maybe not so much boosting, but I just miss being able to move fast and that sort of thing because the stock, stock. That's what I got in my head. The stock. You don't get stock with this one, so you can't move faster. But. I said I'm going a bit more sniper with it, so yeah, yeah I've got about eight games, but uh, yeah, I'm going to stream some more of that, and I will get on Infinite Warfare. What well, I had a bit of a plan actually, I was going to stream uh, Infinite Warfare, the, the campaign, which is awesome actually. You should watch it. You know what I mean? Dog fights in space. Uh, I was going to stream this, but I didn't get round to it because it took ages to bloody download. Uh, but yeah, yeah, so. No idea is like I said, I'll, I'll I'll stream it, put what I want out, and I'll do a video saying my my views. Like I said, what what I think of it, and what other people think of it are completely different. So, uh, but like I said, movement. I like the movement in uh, Infinite Warfare. Uh, I liked it in Black Ops, to be honest, and I didn't mind it in uh, Advanced Warfare. Uh, move. Uh, obviously, very slow in Modern Warfare. A lot of camping. So yeah, people. You're gonna have to get your sniping eyes in just to uh, just to take out most of these people. Then you got perks. That's some very good perks in Infinite Warfare. Uh, the weapon perks. Well, that's another thing, isn't it? I've seen you can only get certain weapons through supply drops. So pay to win, but I'll go on to that later. Uh, the perks on Modern Warfare very very basic. Uh, I remember the last stand uh, and all all them similar type of things. So, but you've got to be a bit more. God, you need UAV thing up. But yeah, yeah, yeah. It's weird. It's weird. I, what I'll do, I'll, I'll explain it in a stream. What I'll do, it's going to be easier actually. What I'll do, I'll, I can go over everything. Then just watch the stream. You know what I mean? That thought's the whole thing. But if I'm trying to get a bit of information across, I'll, I'll do it there and then in the stream. So uh, maps, uh, Infinite Warfare maps. They're too small for the movement system. Uh, whereas Modern Warfare, if they had the movement system, they'd just be about the right size. It's mental, isn't it? So, but I, I don't mind Modern Warfare. Uh, like I said, I wasn't long out the forces myself when all this stuff come out, so that's why I like it. You know what I mean? I'd fight, I, I've literally fired most of the weapons in this and all that sort of stuff. So, 
and I actually know a few SAS boys. Uh, yeah, they're fucking mental. <laughs> fucking are, oh, man. So, yeah, yeah, what do I think? If you want Modern Warfare, is it worth paying 60, 70 quid just for the game? I don't believe I, I You really, really want to get it, people, but yeah, I don't know. You'd have to be mad. You would. I'll well, say that. Nah, we're all fucking mad in our own fucking ways anyway, ain't we? So, but you do get more than just thing you don't. You get zombies, which I ain't a big fan of, but I might start getting into that because I, I know people do like that type of thing. But, uh, yeah, yeah. Like I said before, thing I remember, the campaign is where they spend most of their money on these games. Say it costs a billion pounds to produce and all that sort of stuff. £750 million of that will be the development of the game itself. Because all all the perks, well not the perks even, all the weapons in in these games are weapons you, you, you're finding throughout the bloody, throughout the campaign anyway. So, but play the campaigns people. I don't, I don't get why people don't play them. Like I've said, I'll say it again. The best way to get good with the weapons and the movement system is actually to play the game. I know it sounds mad and out there, but it's true, it's true, you know what I mean? It, it, you get learned to do all the different things, what works, what doesn't work, and what weapons you like and what you don't like, you know what I mean? Because people bitch about weapons, but what, I don't know, we'll go back to Drifter again. And go, this weapon is shit hot. It wasn't Drifter actually, someone called Nero. Don't, don't get me wrong, these are good people, they know what they're on about and all that sort of stuff. He goes, well, it's a one burst. They're fucking, they ain't been one bursting for me. That's the M16, that is the three bursts, the burst one in the Modern Warfare. Yeah, yeah, nightmare, nightmare. So, Infinite Warfare versus Modern Warfare. Uh, they're both good. They really are, they really are. Uh, to say this is a freebie isn't really, is it? You know what I mean? You are paying for it. You have to literally have the Infinite Warfare disc in the game to play it. Which means you can't buy it in a floggy Infinite Warfare one trying to get a bit of money because you need the disc to fucking play it. So they're not fucking stupid. Uh, supply drops. Obviously they're not in this. Uh, I haven't really... I've learnt my lesson on that. I, fuck it, it, they're not worth it. They're not worth it, you know what I mean? So and they're going to be the same odds and all that sort of stuff again. So, yeah, something about pay to win. Well, what will happen is if you throw a load of money at them, you're more likely to get... The weapon, which is locked behind the wall, I think you can get it if it's only in supply drops. You do get supply drops, as in you earn them. But the chances of that happening, I don't know. In Infinite War, uh, not Infinite Warfare, Black Ops, I was quite lucky. I had the Marshals, I had the Grant, but I didn't get the ones I really wanted. That's the, the Scar, would have been, not the Scar, I can't even know what it is. The Peacemaker, that would have been a lovely weapon to have, but. I'm not paying 35 quid just for a chance to win it. <laughs> you know, you're mental. You're mental. I, people can do what they want with their own money, but yeah, yeah. Because it really doesn't mean anything at the end of the day, does it? You know? So anyway, almost at the end of the video. Uh, yeah, yeah. Uh, which one's best? They're both, this, they're both good, actually. The campaign is absolutely awesome in Inf uh, Infinite Warfare. Like I said, multiplayer. I haven't heard good things yet. Uh, I'm going to continue playing Modern Warfare. I, I might even, I'm going to stream the rest of the mission. Uh, but yeah, yeah, I've actually been playing it online and I've actually been enjoying it. So it's, it's a nice change and that's what everything's about. It's mixing up your games and that sort of stuff. So yeah, yeah, I wouldn't I wouldn't say one's better than the other. Uh, and I'm like, I'm going to get my money's worth out of it. So I hope you do. So thanks for watching everyone. There's only about 20 seconds left on the video, so what I'll do, I'll catch you all later.